FIFA 19 is finally here, and if you want any cheap MSP or PSN for FIFA points or some cheap game codes, check out G2A.com. I'll leave a link down below in the top line of the description and use code HABER for 3% cash back. How is it going, everybody, and welcome back to a brand new video. In today's video, what I've got for you guys is some two-player packs. Now, we have some two-player packs from the gold upgrade. If you guys... I don't know how you wouldn't know, but I'm going to talk about it anyway. If you guys don't know, in the upgrade section, we have bronze upgrade, silver upgrade, and gold upgrade. And for the gold upgrade, you submit a team of 11 gold plays with 50 chemistry, I believe, or 40 chemistry. They could be non-rare or rare. Could even be special cards if you really desire. Um, and it just has to be 11 gold with 40 chemistry. Um, gives you a two-player pack. Gives you a gold rare two-player pack. Two golds, two rares. Um, and you have the chance to get something really, really great. Now, I've not done a two-player pack video in quite a while, but my two-player pack look is pretty decent. Now, if I go over to my club really quickly, and this is after a couple SBCs of rinsing, like, a lot of high-rated, untradeable cards. But I've got the likes of Thiago Silva, Casemiro, Koulibaly, Alexandro, Firmino, Matic, a lot of other players from... Uh, you know, gold upgrade. So I thought I'd go ahead and do another one. We have the likes of Inform Hulk, Mbappe, and a few others to uh, to potentially get in these gold upgrades. So I thought I would just go ahead and do a couple of gold upgrades for a video. I really enjoy doing gold upgrades. Now, a lot of people don't think that gold upgrades are worth it. In my personal opinion, I think that they genuinely are. I think that at the minute, they're about four and a half thousand coins to complete. You can maybe do it for a bit cheaper if you spend a bit more time either bidding or sniping players. And you get the chance to get something really good. If you hit a high rated card, it's going to help you out with SBCs longer down the line. If you don't, then you've got rare players for a potential full rare SBC that's also going to grant you better players later down the line as well. And maybe you just hit something that's useful, maybe a buy, maybe a walker, someone like that you can use in your squad. It's genuinely, it's like all relative to the, to the cards that you get. But I think that it is a worth it way to, to get some decent players. And if you guys are running Rotor Glories, um, they're a good method to submit your div rival non res that you don't want from like untradeable packs and get some decent packs and potentially get something good. So, and if you're just a pack addict like me and you spend FIFA points and you're just addicted to packs, another great way to satisfy the pack addiction is just th from some gold upgrade packs. Save yourself some, uh, some money. But uh, we're going to start off here. We've got John Stones. 82 rated is our best out of three so far. I'm gonna, I've am gonna, i got 15 loaded up. I might go ahead and rinse uh, a bunch of these rares through the uh, the gold upgrade again after this if we don't get anything good. I think that there's no point keeping the rares in the club if you spend a lot of FIFA points. If you don't, then it's definitely worth being patient and holding on to the cards. But if you spend a bunch of FIFA points like I do and you're just a shadow that wastes a load of money, uh, no point keeping the rares in my opinion because when the new promos come out, I will whack on a bunch of FIFA points. So it doesn't really matter regardless. So we're four in and we've packed nothing so far. Hopefully we can improve our pack luck. Doesn't look like this pack is going to be the one. However, I will say as we get a board, there's a lot of non-walkouts that are very good boards to get. This wasn't one of them. You know, having Martinez an 84 and he's not bad, but he's not, you know, he's not going to save me any money on it. Well, he might save me a few K on SBC, but uh, he's not fantastic. However, there's players like Hyung Min Son. Uh, Van Dijk is a great one. Fabinho is another fantastic one. These are all non-walkout board drops that could potentially save you 100,000 coins on a player if you choose to use them in the squad. Um, and I think that's just uh, another good way to try and get yourself some decent players in the club. Servi's not one of those decent players, but you know what I mean. It's just one of those things. Uh, and, and you've got to get incredibly lucky, of course. There is a luck element to all of this. You're not going to get a, a war card every three packs. But there is, if you do get lucky, if you've got relatively good pack luck, you've got a good chance of hitting something decent. Now, uh, we're yet to hit something incredible so far. Um, and we've got a bunch of non-boards, so it's not looking it's it's looking pretty pretty bleak for us right now. However, it takes one pack to turn the pack look around completely. I'm hoping that that one pack is gonna come very soon. Because if it doesn't, then we're in a bit of trouble. Uh, but we've got eight packs left, so uh let's go with uh with this one. Let's go with this pack. Come on here, give us a walkout, please. It's not gonna be a walkout. That's disappointing. Boards at least. Not even going to be a board. It's going to be Sane from Schalke. Not great at all. Not great. But um, we will move on with these, I guess. Uh, I'm hoping to pack at least something decent. Two Schalke plays in one pack. FIFA Myths. Get Majesty Gamer on it. <laughs> um, all right. We'll go with uh, with this one here. I think this is pack number four or five. I'm not entirely sure. No walkout, sadly. I thought we might get better looks. I've not done these in a while. We're getting inform. Hang on. Scottish. Right mid. Forest. Not bad. Um... 
91 pace, 94 pace even, 84 dribbling. Not a ridiculously bad looking card to be fair. Um, he's only got a value of about 11,000 coins sadly, but it's not bad. It is not bad. It, it's okay. Um, I'm quite happy with that. We got Ricardo Patricio, uh, Ricardo Patricio, Rui Patricio in the same pack as well that I have a tradable version of, but that is not bad. I'll take that. Uh, pretty poor physical stats. In fact, awful physical stats. Um, great agility and balance. Great pace. Apart from that, pretty awful stats in general, but it's an inform that we could potentially use for an SBC later down the line. So I'm happy with that. And it's 11,000 coins worth of a player that we just got as well. So not too bad. I would prefer a walkout. If we could hit a walkout at any point in this video, that would be great. But that's not too bad though. That is not bad at all. Um, as we get ourselves Enna Valencia, who has incredible pace actually. What the hell? Now, I wanted to quickly check one thing with Enna Valencia. I'm pretty sure this guy has not had good pace before. Uh, I, I never thought of Enna Valencia as someone with great pace. Enna Valencia. Okay. Uh, maybe maybe I'm spelling this wrong, but uh, I don't know how to spell it, so I want to quickly check. I, I don't know why, but this always bugs me. Stuff like this bugs me. Okay, so he wasn't even on FIFA 14. FIFA 15. Hello? FIFA 15, here we go. He had a West Ham card. Oh, he had 86 pace, to be fair. Maybe I'm just chatting rubbish. Maybe I'm just off my head. I'm, I'm, I'm crazy. But he has four-star skills, actually. Not a bad-looking card. Not a bad looking card. 90 jumping. He's only 5 foot 9 though. 80 stamina. Decent pace. You know, that wouldn't be a horrific card for a starter squad to be fair. Not that bad. Not that bad at all. Fair enough. I didn't think he'd be that good. Okay. Here we go. Walk out. Oh. I mean, oh, rubbish. French. CDM. <laughs> oh my god. N'Golo Kante. Oh my god. We've played in Golo Kante in a two rep. He's nearly 400k on, on PlayStation. 300k on Xbox. Oh my god. Bro, what? Oh my god. Okay. What? And De Vries in the same pack. Oh my god. That is unreal. That is absolutely unreal. Damn, dude. What? That card looks absolutely insane. That card looks insane. He just looks absolutely phenomenal. Damn, dude. Holy crap. We just got an 89 rated 300k plus walkout in a two upgrade pack. In a two rare gold upgrade pack. That is nuts. I'm genuinely shocked by that. I'm genuinely shocked by that. I don't know why I just repeated myself. I don't know why I just repeated myself. I'm sorry. I'm, I did that one on purpose. Oh my god. Let's freaking go. That's actually a weird pack. Both Bournemouth players. I'm, I'm elated. I am elated. I'm absolutely ecstatic. Damn. Wow. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. I won't be surprised if we get absolutely nothing for the rest of these packs. That is unbelievable. That is better than I could have even asked for. The thing, The annoying thing is... I genuinely do not play much on this account, and I have so many incredible and tradables, as you already saw the Intradable Club. So maybe I'll have to switch back over to Xbox or something. I'm not entirely sure. Wow, wow, wow. Okay. Well, we have one more. I'm gonna go ahead and cycle a couple more players through. That is nuts. That that is actually nuts. That is absolutely incredible. That right there is absolutely incredible. I'm genuinely shocked. I'm I, I'm blown away by that. Very blown away by that. As we end off with a bender, pretty accurate. Uh, we're going to go ahead and submit a couple more plays into these SBCs and do like one or two more. So uh, I'll see you guys when we've got them loaded up. Gone ahead and done two more. As you see, uh, we've just... Oh, wait, I'm doing the silver upgrade. Oh, I'm stupid. Okay. Um, I have no idea why I just did the silver upgrade there, but we will have done two more in just a second. I am genuinely still so shocked at that, that pack. Uh, that is, I think... Is it? That is literally the best player I've packed all year. That's the best player I've packed this year so far. And it came on my money account in a gold upgrade pack. Of course it did. <laughs> I don't even care. I'm so happy with that. I'm, I'm, I'm absolutely ecstatic. So uh, let's go ahead and submit that and get the last two opened. That's unbelievable. My untradable club of this account is insane. 
If I ever get bored or get sick of a road of glory, I might just come straight back to Xbox because, hell yeah, this club is looking pretty damn stacked. So uh, I'm pretty happy with that. In the first one of the last two, we get Rafa. I just hit my mic. I apologize if you heard it. Um, in the last pack, sorry, in the second to last pack, the penultimate pack, we got Rafa. Okay, the last pack of the video. Can we, if we get another walkout, I think I'll flip shit. I think I'll absolutely flip a desk. It's going to be a non-board drop, but that's okay. Honestly, it's fine. We get Pedro. We get Pedro. Pedro. Fair enough. Fair enough. So uh, that's not bad. That, that honestly is not, not bad at all. I'll, I need to look at it again, dude. <laughs> I, know, I know it sounds pretty sad, but I'm just, I'm, I'm blown away. I'm, I'm actually blown away. I am actually blown away, dude. Oh my word. He's just so many coins as well that I've got chilling in the club now. Look at all these untradables I've got in this club. I could make such a sick squad. You know, I've got a 100k player there in Alexandro. Uh, in fact, how much are all these cards going for? Casemiro, what are you going for right now? Casemiro is currently 60,000 coins on Xbox. So 370k currently. Thiago Silva, I'm going to tally up and see what my, my first page of untradables were. Thiago Silva is also 60. So 430. Koulibaly is currently Koulibaly. Can't even type. This is on Footman, by the way. So what we are? 430. That takes up to 470. 470. I'm not going to count the blue cards. Um, or maybe we should, actually. Maybe we should. We're at 470. Boateng. I have no idea how much Boateng goes for, which is also a fantastic pull. Uh, what we are? 470. That takes us up to uh, 684. for Bo 214 for Boateng. 684. Hummels is going for... That takes us up to 900. Wow. That takes us up to 970k in just those cards. 970k in just the first page. That takes us up to over a mil. Easy. That is unbelievable. I'm genuinely blown away. That is incredible. If you enjoyed this video, leave a like down below. Subscribe to my channel if you guys are new around here. Ow. And I'll see you later.